Okay, so it says analyze. Sam said that 3 half divided by 3 fourths equals 8 ninths. Draw a model and use words to explain why Sam's statement is not reasonable. Okay, so I'm kind of looking at this one from a couple different mindsets here. Okay. And what I want to find out, even though I really don't like working with um, mixed numbers from my visual here, I think I want to find out, especially since these can be fourths. Let's see. I'm going to use Texas to see how many that is. So two times what is going to get me closer to three? Well, my denominator is going to stay the same. Two times one is going to get me closer to three without going over plus one. Okay, so one and a half. And I want to divide that by three fourths. So let's see, I can do a number line, okay. There we go. That would be One half, that would be one, and that would be one half. So sure enough, I have one half, two halves, three halves. Okay, so that does prove it. And I need to divide that by fourths. Okay, so if this is put that over there. So I've got one fourth, two fourths, three fourths, four fourths, one fourths, two fourths, three fourths, right? And I want to divide that by how many three-fourths? So that's three out of four. And let me get that a little bit closer there. Because that's one-fourth, two-fourths three-fourths, right? Right there. That's two and one-fourth. Did I do that model right? Because that's one, two, and then I've got a fourth. So let's see here. Three halves times four thirds. It's 12 over six. So two. Oh, I didn't need that other part. That's where I messed up. It stops right here. So two. There we go. Sure enough, there's only two. So state Sam's statement is not real, is not reasonable. Okay. Another way that I could look at that and automatically know it's because of 
the dividing fraction is less than one, my, my quotient, my answer is going to be greater than the original. Okay. So Sam is not correct. because three-fourths is less than one, so my quotient has to be greater than dividend.